What's up, YouTube? It's Boomatic back at it with another video. I'm here at Coppola Customs. We have a new uh, interior cleaning product from Shine Armor, and I just wanted to see how this will work on the F-150. It's dusty, I haven't cleaned it since I bought it, and um, I, I wanna see the difference it will make on the vinyls, and it, it's also good for leathers. And yeah, also you can use it on, it looks like anything, um, full interior cleaner. Uh, you have a lot of, you have a lot of mixture in the truck, obviously, some vinyl, some leather, <laughs> some plastics. So we can pretty much try it on everything. And uh, just gonna see how the finish comes out, how it cleans, if we need to do a little bit more, how many applications, whatever, you know, we're just gonna try to figure it out. Looks like a great bottle, great advertising. The spray bottle seems really nice. Uh, it's got a really nice fan on it. So pretty much what you're gonna do is we're gonna test something on this panel to show the panel. You know, it's got normal grime and dirt. It's, it's normal, it's a truck. Austin just grabbed this not long ago, so now we can really start to clean it up. What we're gonna do, we do this all the time to really show you how dirty this is. You won't really notice it until you see that perfect line. Um, what we can do is we'll just put a little bit of tape, a couple sprays onto a rag. A little bit on the rag here. We're just gonna wipe this in to this plastic. It's got a really nice, like almost citrus, lemony smell. Yeah, it smells good. Yeah, it smells really good. Cleaned up pretty well. Nice shine to it, nothing crazy. It's more of a cleaner again. You can actually see the dirt coming off onto the rag. I can work around here with a brush. Then you're gonna take the other rag, you're just gonna kind of wipe off and buff the excess material off. Yeah, so it's a two rag method. Yep. Pipe on, wipe off with, yeah. the, clean, with the clean <laughs> rag. Yeah. You know, you could always go back, you know, with a brush when you gotta get in here. Around the switches is usually another time. You can actually see the dirt. Oh, you know, yeah. nothing crazy, but it's just normal grime. But let's see if we have a, uh, Nice little clean line here. Oh, yeah. Yep. But that's just a line. quick wipe. Yeah. You can see the difference. Obviously, you know, if you use a little bit more, you get a little bit more on it. It feels way cleaner. This is more sticky. This is nice and smooth. It's clean. Um, some other things that we do also is you could also take these. We buy these on Amazon, on eBay. They're super cheap. Nice little brush. You can spray it into the brush, like that. And then you can get in your grooves. Oh, get yeah. All around here. You know, in your edges that you can't really get with a rag. And then around here, you can get in. You can use these brushes on everything. They're super soft. They actually have a uh, harder one, too but you don't want to use anything that's going to scratch anything. Again, wipe off with the more wet one. Around your edges. So now at least that line is clean, up here is clean. Along here was all dirty and nasty. You know, and this is just a really quick one. You can yeah. get obviously crazier as you go, but you could even see like in here, it's a ton of dirt in that corner. Yeah. You know, you could even, there's a little bit more. To there. I love that smell. Yeah, it smells really good. You take these, obviously get around your switches. Again, yeah, just a quick thing. It works really well. It takes the takes the dirt right out of it. And again, it's a cleaner. And then you could always do a protection or something on top. But it's a cleaner. And I mean, this to be clean like that, it yeah, looks great. Definitely night and day difference. You yeah. guys see it? Almost back to you know original. Yeah. You could just go through and clean it all. Um, another heavy traffic area that's here 
These are plastics. The tape out of the way. Um, you can see it's super dirty in here. Also, with something like this, it's got you know hard grooves and stuff. You can use a different type of scrub brush. But we're gonna try product first, couple sprays, and we'll do an area here. Yeah, there you can see the wow. dirt. Yeah. And buff it off. Oh yeah. Huge you guys difference. can see that difference right there. That's a big difference. And that took seconds. Yeah. yeah. That didn't take any time at all. It's not like you're sitting there killing yourself, hurting your arm trying to trying to scrub it. Yeah, so it takes and the dirt off pretty easy. Yep. So just... A couple scrubs here. What we'll do is put a couple into scrub brush again if you got like an area in here you want a scrub brush you can also use the other one that we were using it's just a little bit smaller of a scrub brush just to get the heavy stuff and in the nooks and crannies that you can't really get with a rag yeah go back wipe it in with the rag there's a couple sprays on the rag on the gasket the weather stripping here Go ahead and wipe the rest of it off. Oh yeah, that looks way better. <laughs> nice and clean. Yeah, back to classy guys, Ashley to classy. <laughs> so now, what we can do with this. Do some of the leather. Again, let me flip this over so we're not rubbing dirt into dirt. You can see the product still on the rag. Couple sprays. Let's see what it does to this leather. Here, buff the rest of it off. You can see it clean big time. Oh yeah, that's a big difference. Oh yeah. You can tell. It's got a nice protection on it also. It's nice and smooth. It's huge difference. This feels super clean. This feels super sticky and dirty. Oh, right yeah, here. yeah. Very sticky right here. Yeah. I ate some pancakes or something. <laughs> <laughs> so, but yeah, yeah, very smooth right here. Yeah. Definitely. And we could use it on everything. We could do the steering wheel, wipe down the steering wheel. We could use the dash. Anything that's inside the truck. Um, you know, even your plastics out here, you could probably use it on if you, you needed something quick. And overall product is very good. Um, definitely gonna be using it in the future. Again, Shine Armor. Yeah. Yeah, it's a great product. Yeah, definitely, nice I love that smell. It reminds me of, uh, you know, your mother cleaning on Sunday morning yeah, or something exactly. like that. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Yeah. Uh, citrusy, right? Yeah, maybe I'll we'll just finish this off in here. Awesome. It gets a thumbs up. <laughs> yeah, it definitely thumbs up. <laughs> and it does have a protecting in there too. Yep. Yep. UV protection. It's not greasy and grimy like you know slick and nasty it's not like a lot of products leave that really nasty slippery feel yeah it's nice it, it brings it back to almost like an oem feel okay and that's what's really nice yeah you can see it you can feel the difference yep do it like that and then if you need to get around here a little trick that we use a lot too And then we usually take a little bit of air. So 
see how clean that came? Oh yeah, that's nice. You guys can see the difference. Clean, brought, brought it back. Brought it back to 2012. Yep. <laughs> Shine armor, highly recommend it. It got me looking right. <laughs> yep. Uh, two thumbs up. <laughs> got that right. Yep, and he's this is a guy is a, you know, a professional detailer, vinyl wrap. Um, all customization. So we're gonna try it on my dirty rubber floor mat, uh, weather mat. Yep. To see if the shine armor works. Yeah, I mean you can so see it's is... obviously really dirty. Um, what we're gonna do with this one is just gonna spray a couple times, just in the spot, see how how it reacts. Put a little bit into our scrub brush. With these rubber mats, they're really, you really got to put some effort into them. So with the heavy, you know, hard bristles, it's way easier to like get into, you know, deep grooves and stuff like that. So usually I'll just go back and forth with the product. Sometimes I'll add a little bit of water just to get a little bit more lubrication and stuff on there, a little bit more saturation. You know, again, this is just a really quick process of cleaning it to do something like this or wash it first but we just wanted to try to see what the, the product was actually gonna do you know normally you could even like hose it off to get some of the dirt off before you do this but if you don't have any water or you're out somewhere that you know you, you go into a car show or something real quick and you want to just clean up your floor mats just want to see how this is going to work. Just trying to get all the grooves. You can already see the difference. Oh yeah. Wow, that's major. Wow, and you know the floor mats, that's gonna probably be your dirtiest piece of rubber or vinyl. It you know is, just like that step. You know, you, yeah. any dirt that you track is going directly from the ground onto that step, onto your pedals and your floor mat. Yeah. But you can see, obviously, that's And that's, that's without half a pre-wash or rinsing it off? That's with nothing else. You know, you can, and if you're detailing a car somewhere or whatever, you know, you got water, you got a power washer, you gotta at least get some of the dirt off first. You know, especially in here and stuff. Yeah. Get it out first, dry it up a little bit, spray this on, work it into the plastic or the rubber. It's gonna protect too at the same time and it's gonna clean. So So it definitely it definitely cool. works. That's a 50-50. Yeah. You know, and again that took 30 wow. seconds. Yeah. You know what I mean? It not not long at all. Awesome. Um, sometimes if you got a bigger scrub brush, you know, uh, you know, a bigger hand one or like a four-inch one or whatever. It'll just make your life a little bit easier, quicker. Yep. You know, a lot of people detailing cars, you gotta be quick, you gotta make the money. So in and out, but again, you're at a car show or something, you got a little bit of dirt in your floor mat. You have this in your trunk, look how small, like these are nice test ones. You keep these in your, your door. Yes. You know, these are quick and you know, a rag or two, spray it quick, wipe it down, you're, you're done. Perfect. Yeah. Yes, sir. So that's a, that's a big yes on Shine Armor. <laughs> All right. um, this is definitely, I could definitely see this bringing us into, you know, our product line and using it every day. Okay. Yep. Uh, awesome. All right, guys. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe to Spoomatic Cars, and you'll be seeing more videos like this. Everything about, mostly about cars. And, um, yep. All right. Thanks for watching. <laughs>